Well, hello everyone, welcome back to another one of these. Hello, YouTube, and welcome to the World Wide Web, or the Internet, or the Interwebs. Uh, hello everybody, and welcome back to my corner of YouTube here, here on a brilliant night here at, uh, here in my room, here in my studio, um, my recording realm, uh, uh, this is another vlog, and it is another day for me to yak to the camera, and it is also another day <laughs> in my life. Yes, it is another day in my life. I'm bringing back that old catchphrase, um, for my old subscribers and my new subscribers. I'm bringing back my old catchphrase. I just love it. Um, I'm actually not going to talk about work today because I'm going to give work a break. I'm going to give April's updates a break because she's doing good. Um, there's not much of a change, you know, I just want to keep her rhythm and everything. Her rhythm's good and all that other stuff. And I just want to give everything else a rest. I wanted to talk to you guys about something that, uh, has, um, uh, has been, um, been really on my mind for the last couple of months and, uh, has been, um, really been, um, eating away at me, uh, for the last couple of, uh, well, it hasn't been eating away at me, but it's been, but it's been a, uh, but it's been one of those things that I've been thinking a lot, a lot lately. And, um, something that I've, uh, I've, I've wanted to talk about. And one thing is that I've, and one thing that I have, uh, one thing that, I have been contemplating over um, talking about on this channel because uh, so guys I'm um, so it's come to my attention um, in the recent weeks and in um, and everything that uh, you know, I've been looking at my channel stats, I've been looking at my subscribers, and I've been looking at everything else, um, and don't worry, I'm not gonna quit YouTube, I'm just gonna put it out right there, um, I want to, um, tell you guys that, um, I have been noticing a lot of you guys are probably wondering, um, am I going to weigh on the demonetization of YouTube? Am I going to really, um, am I going to, uh, focus on that? Am I going to weigh in my opinion? So for those of you who are on YouTube and know it very well, you obviously have to adhere to certain guidelines on YouTube in order to have your content published. And well, you can publish your your content, but you obviously have to follow a certain amount of guidelines so that you can be on it. Um, it's been my uh, it's been in my I've been tracking this since it started happening. A while back and um what demonetization if you guys do not know it's youtube's word of saying we're not going to pay you know we're not going to we're not going to allow you to earn money off your content because of what it entails and what everything entails i just want to i just want to weigh in for those people who do this regularly as a business and it's their income or whatever because you know we're in a free country you can do whatever you want to make your make a buck whatever you have to do to make a buck in this country you have to make a buck you know you can this is a free country you know you can make a buck um bagging groceries stocking shelves running a business um uh, hunting hunting and serving fur trade furs skins and all this other stuff um uh, 
people selling their bodies out in the world of out the world of prostitution just to make the quick buck even though i think that's 100 percent um not morally right for some people but some people figure that's the only way to survive in life because that's the only way they can get by um but i just wanted to weigh in on how disgusted i am that in a free country where we have the right to do anything in this um we should be able to post content we want and be able to uh share our views and everything and share what we know our knowledge of the world um i don't get why um why this happens because i know i know uh youtube's been a fickle beast i mean i know i've tackled comments and everything but you know for those content creators out there that use this as a job um it's unfair to you guys because you guys put time and effort to your videos you guys put them out almost every other day or every day i know a few people that put uh videos every day there are uh horror narrators be busta uh corpse husband keely elise who's actually leaving youtube unfortunately because of the steam monetization crap um i i know there's legal reasons obviously why why the videos get flagged to get demonetized but you guys got to you guys got to imagine that people are trying to do this aren't trying to do this for entertainment youtube is not all about entertainment this I just want to put this out there. Does me talking for 5, 10, 15, 30 minutes, an hour, eternity, does that seem like entertainment to you guys? No, this is just a talk show. Or, or, uh, this is just a talk show or a radio show. It's not meant to be entertaining. I'm not juggling, well, except for the gameplay. I'm not juggling things. I'm not juggling. I'm not juggling. I'm not playing. Sp I'm not balancing spoons on my nose. I'm not having, I'm not doing any really incredible stunts. I'm not doing anything really stupid. I'm just talking to you to the camera. Um, you know, it's just not all about entertainment. YouTube is a platform for us to um, voice our First Amendment rights, freedom of speech, right to present, assembly, whatever. Uh, well, actually, not freedom to present is not one. Disregard that one. But we have the freedom to say what we want to say and present what we want um, because it's a freedom of speech. Well, you know, if we want to inform others about something, uh, like Kaylee informs about missing persons cases, nameless cases, dark matters, cases that have gone cold for three, two, three, maybe four decades, five decades, whatever. Um, and I just find it disgusting that... Um, you know, these people pour their hearts and souls out into these videos and they don't get credit for them. Um, they're just trying to do it. I mean, I've, I mean, I understand why they did monetize Kaylee Lisa's stuff. And Kaylee, if you're out there, uh, I think you, I think you do a great job and everything. And I think it's very interesting to really listen to your cases because you're trying to tell us just how bad the world can be and everything and how. How bad the world can be and how nasty it can be from time to time. And how nasty the world can be from time to time. And there's some people who do makeup tutorials and everything. YouTube, I remember when YouTube first started, it was... I remember when YouTube first started. I remember when I first... I remember the first video I ever watched on YouTube back in 2006 or 2005-2006 was actually a video uh, for Top Gear. It was the first video I ever did. I think it was the Bugatti uh, race to um, from Italy to uh, London, for those of you who know that one. And um, I... 
remember from then on in, I think I was hooked on YouTube. Did I think 10 years later I was going to come up with my own channel? Not in the least bit because I didn't have a camera back then. Nor did I have a phone that could do anything. Um, not like I am now and everything. Um, but I just feel that YouTube's got to get their act straight. And content creators have to have to obviously find other ways is obviously now have to find ways to present their stuff live. Um, we're obviously YouTube, um, stars are obviously going to come and go because I know Kaylee was doing, had been doing those videos since I'm going to say 2000, uh, last four years. So she's had a long run. I mean, she's had a, almost as long as run as I've had, and I've been on and I've been on the web since 2015 uh, Mayish. So my run could end tomorrow, if I wish, but I'm not going to because because I love you guys so much, and you guys give me the views. In fact, I think we're up to 3617, there uh, 3617 views, which is amazing among my 31 subscribers. Thank you all. I will keep going because of this. And it's and I'm pumped just to make that that acquaintance. Um, no, I'm just pumped. Not, I'm just pumped that that's happening. So, um, I know this is not coming from a monetized channel, but I've had a couple of videos flagged, copyrighted, and everything over the years. So I've obviously had to deal with all those pains. But I just feel that content creators. Are getting a little bald a little bit here because you know they're trying to voice they're not trying to voice their opinions they're just trying to state facts shed some light on something or just try to be entertaining you know i i don't know what if if youtube sees this video and you guys want to send me a long comment what why this is feel free Obviously, YouTube is a business, and they need to conduct what they have online, but there's obviously age-restricted content for people, and I don't know what was so wrong about putting that on your channel so you can tell viewers this is not suitable for kids under a certain age. There's a reason why, and, and Kaylee Elise even says disclaimer in front of her video, this is... Sometimes the sometimes does a disclaimer in front of our videos that this disturbing content, there's elements of this, this, and that. And she even says it sometimes in the sometimes when she shows images. So I don't even know why that's there. Um, it's maybe the darker side of YouTube. Um, most of the horror narration and all that other stuff, it's more of the darker side, and I've been watching that it's just it's just something to make you think you know how lucky you are to to be alive and all this other stuff and you know it's just how different your life can be you know because you never know um for those business people out there that use youtube i hope they solve this demonetization conundrum because it's unfair to people that are running a business at the end of the day when you are trying to make money and you're trying to do something with your with your channel, you're trying to make money. You're trying to run a business, just like YouTube is. I, I don't understand why that is, but I digress. Obviously, unless you were, unless you unless you were shooting a video that wasn't age restrictive, you streaking around Boston Common or something, then I'd then I'd have to say. Yeah, then that's something you wouldn't want to monetize because that's just flat out weird. Um, it's just, um, it's, um, that's, <laughs> but you guys know what I mean. You, you know, this, you know, that's a, that's something that would be get demonetized because it's obviously promoting, uh, promiscuity and whatever, what and lewdness and, in public decency, that sort of thing. Um, but yeah, I, I just don't get it. If YouTube wants to send me send me a long a long uh, 
sent me a long uh, email. Um, YouTube, my uh, my uh, email address is mcomo15 at yahoo.com if you guys wish to tell me what's going on. I've read your community guidelines and everything, and um, I'm pretty sure that that's that hurting a business and in a in a uh, freedom of speech is is an unwritten. I'm sorry to say this, but the Constitution um, overrides any business. I'm sorry, but well, it shouldn't override any business because the First Amendment and the Second Amendment, of course, which I say Amen and long live in my uh, videos. So, um, but yeah, if you guys want to, but yeah, if you guys want to comment and do it, but. I don't know what the hell happened to the First Amendment and us reporting on this, this, and that. It just doesn't make sense to me. So if anybody's got a clue on how this is and how screwed up this country is because of the First Amendment and not allowing people to say their views and demonetizing stuff for doing all this and showing just being informative of people. So it just boggles my mind, but I've just discussed it about it. And... Uh, it's the reason why I will never monetize my my stuff because I barely get any views. I barely, I barely, um, I shouldn't say I barely get any views. Sorry, but it's just that I'm not. What I meant to say is my channel volume isn't high enough to get the views to be monetized, and I don't do ad revenue because I don't do that. That's that, that's poor. You guys won't want to sit me talking for sixteen minutes while. Well, in ad revenue, unless I'm being informative and I have an informative video going on, um, or I'm trying to do a makeup tutorial, or I'm trying to do a shaving tutorial, whatever, or how not to be a how not to be dumb on YouTube, um, or not how to be a lame brain on YouTube, then so be it. All right, guys, I'm gonna I already talked enough, and this is my longest vlog in a long time. Uh, but everybody, long live America, good bless America, long live democracy, long live the Second Amendment, amen to my grandparents, my grandparents' spirits, my both of them, uh, oh, and long live the First Amendment, definitely, and have a good day. Mike Mo here for the vlog here on April 11, 2019, here for Day Energy 894. Peace out, everybody. I'll see you guys in 895 tomorrow.